lost in the city, still so far from home. I've searched for you all my life. Cast out like a shadow, racing towards the light. I pray to see you one more time. If we just hang in, we know Russia can and will make mistakes at the end of matches. Touch off the top, dug by Jiba. Marilo, change of pace. Not a lot of heat on that ball, and I would not be surprised if Daniele Bagnoli called an early timeout. Russia has come out very stagnant and very flat. And you could see Volkov and Kazakov, as I thought, back in the lineup in the middle. Russia can't put a ball to the floor. Chichukin. Oh, what a dig by Jiba. Tight pass. And Bisotto over the top. All Brazil right now. Looking for the 5-0 lead. Mikhailov, Jiba everywhere. Oh, they let that ball drop. Volkov. Sadao again, no. Chiba over the top into the deep cross court corner. Chiba's been bothered by a lot of injuries the last year or so. He had a very severe ankle injury the very beginning stages of the World League last season. He now wears ankle braces to try to prevent that. Missed a couple of matches in Brazil at the start of the 2008 season. And then at the Beijing Olympic Games, he had a very sore shoulder, so. But now physically 100%, and word was he did not have the best of seasons at all for his Russian professional team. Jiba again, left side, same shot. Good adjustment that time by Chichukin. And that ball to the floor. Very smart. Jiba wants to work cross court on Chichukin. And that is for contacts. That ball into the top of the tape. That pipe combination unsuccessful by Russia. Well executed play. The timing was there. Maybe that set could be a little bit higher. Everybody runs it a little bit differently. Brazil used to run it. Ice serve. Chiba right over the top of Yuri Bereshko. What fantastic location, and I've talked about the contact excellence of Jiba. A lot of players, when they them last night in their 3-1 loss to Serbia. Pipe combination, Jiba putting the ball to the floor again. Jiba has just been a remarkable player for a long time, now 32 years of age, and got some great news recently. He's been playing overseas for the last eight seasons, six of those in Italy and the last two in Russia. But there has been a huge infusion of cash and sponsorships in Brazil. So he has just signed a new three-year contract with a club in Sao Paulo, so he will be heading home probably to conclude his professional career. He, he and uh, all of the Brazilians are coming back home. And they are absolutely thrilled. Not that they were ever treated badly or, or certainly weren't paid a, a small fortune. But uh, wonderful to play back home for the same amount of money. Jiba, change of pace. Jiba at only 192. And anybody who says that there's no room in the game anymore for the smaller player. That serve. But again, Russia will miss more serves than anybody else, maybe in the world. Certainly among the top teams. Jiba on the quick transition play out of the middle. Nobody makes that play better. Off the deflection. And Jiba had a very poor match uh, in the opening of this tournament against Cuba, but he has been Jiba since. So that play develops so fast. And also Brazil sets the ball so quickly both to the right and the left sideline that it opens up the middle. Chip 
Pachukin again, and Russia has obviously seen something that that little off-speed shot over the top of a three-man block is going to be open. This is all learned through videotape and scouting tendencies, and Bruno, Bruno was late on that play. Three-man block, maybe release up behind the block. Oh, perfect pass. What a play by Murillo that time. First of all, taking control of that rocket jump serve by Mikhailov. That is just magnificent. And a beautiful set creating the one-on-one -on -one by Bruno. Murillo. A serve in between Bereshko and Verboff. And right now, Bereshko's already been aced twice. This serve just inside the back line with good heat and good change of direction in between two receivers. See that in between Bereshko and Verboff and right on the back line. Perfect execution by Marito. And again. And Jiba is able to score. That very important match. I explain the importance in a moment. Beautiful kill by Fisoto. See, the winner of the match last night between Russia and Serbia will play Cuba in the semifinals. And it is clear that Brazil, the much, much stronger opponent. So if you want to avoid Brazil, you win last night. So it uh, really made up for a lot of head scratching before the match and after last night when Daniele Bagnoli started a, a couple of players that uh, didn't seem quite at the same class as some of the other players we had seen for years for Russia. Stuff block on the outside. Chiba <laughs> combining with Bruno. Sidal went down as they collided on the left side, but just don't quit. Keep playing. So Sidal, the middle blocker, so Jiba makes the nice adjustment. Grankin. Fisoto changing direction of the ball down the line. Looks at Kuleshov on the floor now for Russia. Kuleshov starting the match last night. That ball going right between the arms of Yuri Bereshko and Jiba. Last time he went at Bereshko and same spot. Jiba's got, got some room. Oh, what a shot. That ball almost went down. And that was by design. Fisoto, what a play by Brazil. <laughs> Sergio considered one of the best liberos in the world by far, but also one of the most creative, one of the most flamboyant, and one of the most clever. When he was passing that ball over his head after Jiba made the long run, he was looking for that short cross court. Jiba, 21-15 is the lead. Bereshko is blocked. What a reach to the outside by Murillo. The line was wide open. Bereshko tried to go for it, but Murillo Watch the block on the outside. Murillo late to the outside, but then gets his left hand over the net and turned back inside. Excellent blocking move. Brazil now leading by seven. Make it by six. Jiba missing the jump serve, but still plenty of time in the comfort zone for Brazil, thanks to so many unforced errors by Russia. Absolutely wrong. Jiba at 192, Murillo at 194. The outsider wing spikers having great success against the taller Russians. Chichukin cross court. Here is Murillo. Sergio, quick pass. Keep the tempo moving, and Jiba with a kill once again. Only one set point necessary. And thanks to a very poor start by Russia and a very poor finish by the Russians, Brazil cruises in the opening set by a score of 25 to 17. That was a thumping in the opening set.